Hey everyone and welcome to another GitHub tutorial. In this video, we will explore how to change the default branch in your GitHub repository. The default branch is the branch that GitHub uses as the main line of development. And it's the branch that visitors see when they first visit your repository. By default, GitHub sets the default branch to master for new repositories. However, many projects and organizations prefer to use alternative names like main or develop. In this tutorial, we will walk you through the steps to change your repository's default branch. So first of all, you have to click on the settings button on the top right side of this repository page. So you must be the owner of this repository or you should have sufficient permissions to access this page. So here you will find the heading default branch. So this is where you can change the default branch. So as it is saying, the default branch is considered the base branch in your repository against which all pull requests and code commits are automatically made unless you specify a different branch. So here we have two buttons, rename branch or switch to another branch. We want to switch to another branch. So just click on this button and from here, pick the branch that you want to use. I want to use the main branch. So select that and click on the update and click on I understand update the default branch. All right. Now here you will see the main branch is configured as the as the main branch as the default branch. So now go back to the code section and here whenever you will open this repository page, you will see the main branch as the default and this would be selected by default. Okay. If uh, the branch that you want to set as a default branch does not exist yet, you can create a new branch by clicking on this drop down and type the name of the branch and click on this button. This would create a new branch and then you can set that branch as the default branch. Now any visitors to your branch will now see the contents of the new default branch. Congratulations. You have successfully changed the default branch in your GitHub repository. This can be useful when you want to switch the main line of development or adopt a different naming convention for your branches. It's important to note that changing the default branch does not affect any existing branches or contents of your repository. It simply changes the branch that GitHub uses as default when someone visits your repository. If you have any existing pull requests or branch protection rules, you may need to update them to reflect the new default branch. Remember to communicate the change to your team or collaborators to ensure everyone is on the same page and using the new default branch going forward. If you found this video tutorial helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more GitHub tips and tricks. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching and happy coding.